Hello everyone welcome to back my channel, I hope everyone is having a wonderful day before starting the video, please go ahead and hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. The Colorado native shocked the judges with his singing audition in 2016. A fan on Reddit recently discovered that John passed away on May 14, 2023. I give this is old news for all of you but it's brand new to me, I just learned that John Hetlinger passed away in May. He was a legend and I never forgot how pleasantly surprised I was when he sang Bodies. Rip, they wrote. Oh, I just found this out right now, commented a fan. The Reddit user attached his obituary. According to his obituary, John was born in South Dakota on January 1, 1934. He had many jobs in his life, including being a Lutheran minister, the program manager for the Hubble Space Telescope working with the space-based infrared systems defense, working on the Apollo-Saturn program, and a U.S. Navy pilot. The AGT contestant was married two times, had four children, and adopted two. John was known for his love of karaoke. His sheer passion for singing was unmatched. His rendition of Bodies by Drowning Pool on America's Got Talent will forever be legendary. John's fans eagerly anticipated his performances and were never disappointed, his obituary read. His family shared that his pacemaker was turned off and he died of heart failure. Surprisingly, it was not caused by karaoke-related screaming, they ended. Jones' audition. The AGT judges at the time, Simon Cowell, Heidi Klum, Mel B., and Howie Mandel, were shocked when John began to sing the heavy metal song, Bodies by Drowning Pool. I thought you were going to sing I Did It My Way, Simon told him. Although all four of the judges were shocked, three of them gave him a yes. Haiti was the only one who voted no. The season 11 contestant made it to the Judge Cuts round, where he sang Dragula by Rob Zombie. Simon gave him a standing ovation, but Heidi buzzed him. Sadly, John was eliminated from that round and he did not advance to the quarterfinals. After his time on AGT, John was lucky enough to perform Bodies with Drowning Pool at the 2016 Chicago Open Air Festival. Other AGT DATHs, John is not the contestants who AGT who has died recently. Nightbird, who inspired people with her song, It's OK in 2021, passed away in 2022, after a battle with breast cancer. Her real name was Jane Marshewski, and she was only 31 years old. Nolan Neal was found dead in his apartment in July 2022. The 41-year-old was an AGT and the voice contestant. It is believed that he died from substance abuse. Zuri Craig, a singer, died in October 2022 at the age of 44. No cause of death was given. In December 2021, heavy metal singer, J.J. Phillips died from COVID-19 at the age of 30. Also in December 2021, Scalar Hicks was found dead in her friend's home. AGT fans devastated after beloved contestant John Hetlinger dies at 89. Viewers mourn, legendary performer. John Hetlinger, the unexpected and unforgettable star of America's Got Talent, AGT, has passed away at the age of 89 leaving fans of the show and music lovers across the world mourning the loss of a truly legendary performer. Known for his improbable rise to fame as an octogenarian rock singer, Hetlinger's story of passion, talent, and resilience resonated with millions. Hetlinger became a household name in 2016 when, at the age of 82, he shocked the judges, audience, and viewers at home by delivering a powerhouse rendition of Drowning Pool's heavy metal hit Bodies. A retired aerospace engineer and Navy pilot, Hetlinger's performance was the last thing anyone expected from someone of his age and background. Yet, his passion and energy on stage captivated everyone, making him a fan favorite almost instantly. His death marks the end of an extraordinary life, and tributes have been pouring in from AGT fans, his fellow contestants, and members of the music community who were inspired by his unexpected turn as a heavy metal icon. A life full of surprises. Born in 1935, John Hetlinger lived a life that, 
even before his AGT fame, was anything but ordinary. He served as a Navy pilot in the 1950s and later transitioned into a successful career as an aerospace engineer. His work included contributions to the Hubble Space Telescope, a project that expanded humanity's understanding of the universe. For decades, Hedlinger's life revolved around family, work, and the steady pursuits of science and engineering. Music was always a part of his life, but it remained more of a personal passion than a public endeavor. I always loved singing, but I never thought I'd end up on a stage like AGT, Hetlinger once shared in an interview. The AGT moment that changed everything. When Hetlinger stepped onto the AGT stage, he was a stark contrast to the typical performers. Wearing a simple button-down shirt and glasses, he introduced himself with humility and charm, making his heavy metal song choice all the more shocking. As soon as he roared into the iconic opening line of bodies, the audience erupted in cheers. Judges Simon Cowell, Howie Mandel, Mel B., and Heidi Klum were left stunned. Simon, known for his often brutal honesty, admitted he had never seen anything like it, while Howie praised Hetlinger for breaking stereotypes and showing the world that passion knows no age. The moment became a viral sensation, racking up millions of views on YouTube and propelling Hetlinger to global fame. His performance sparked discussions about ageism, self-expression, and the courage to embrace new challenges at any stage of life. John reminded us that it's never too late to do something extraordinary, a fan wrote on social media. A heavy metal hero. Following his AGT appearance, Hetlinger's life took a dramatic turn. He became a beloved figure in the heavy metal community, earning the respect of fans and musicians alike. Drowning Pool invited him to perform Bodies Live With Them at major music festivals, cementing his status as a true rock star. He was the epitome of what heavy metal is all about, defying norms, embracing individuality, and doing it with unapologetic passion said C.G. Pierce, the guitarist for Drowning Pool. Hedlinger didn't stop at just one performance. He continued to perform at events, including charity concerts, where he used his newfound fame to give back to causes he cared about. His stage presence and undeniable charisma made him a sought-after guest, and he relished every opportunity to share his love of music with others. Fans reacted to the news of his passing. When news broke of Hetlinger's passing, AGT fans and the music community were quick to express their sorrow and celebrate his life. Social media was flooded with messages of love, admiration, and gratitude for the joy and inspiration he brought to so many. John Hetlinger wasn't just a contestant, he was a legend. He showed us all that age is just a number and that it's never too late to live your dreams, wrote one fan. Another commented, the world needs more people like John. He didn't care about fitting in or doing what was expected. He just went for it, and it was incredible to watch. AGT also released a statement honoring Hetlinger, calling him a one-of-a-kind performer whose talent and spirit transcended generations. A legacy of courage and joy. What made Hetlinger so unforgettable was not just his music but his spirit. In a world where societal expectations often box people into roles based on their age, Hetlinger was a breath of fresh air. His story encouraged countless people to pursue their passions, regardless of their circumstances. John's journey is a testament to the fact that it's never too late to reinvent yourself, said Terry Crews, AGT's current host. He wasn't just performing, he was inspiring. Beyond his musical contributions, Hetlinger will be remembered for his kindness, humility, and unwavering optimism. Despite his fame, he never lost the down-to-earth charm that endeared him to so many. Honoring his memory In the wake of his passing, fans and musicians have been brainstorming ways to honor Hetlinger's memory. Some have suggested dedicating an episode of AGT to his legacy while others hope to see a tribute concert featuring the heavy metal community that embraced him so warmly. One particularly touching suggestion came from a fan who proposed creating a scholarship fund in Hetlinger's name to support older adults pursuing creative endeavors. John showed us that it's never too late to follow your dreams, 
the fan wrote. What better way to honor him than by helping others do the same? The man who defied expectations. John Hetlinger's story will continue to resonate long after his passing. He was more than just an AGT contestant. He was a trailblazer who reminded the world of the power of passion and the importance of living life to the fullest. As fans reflect on his legacy, one thing is certain. Hetlinger's impact will not be forgotten. His journey from aerospace engineer to heavy metal hero is a reminder that life is full of surprises, and it's never too late to make a mark on the world. Rest in peace, John Hetlinger. You were truly one of a kind. Thanks for watching this video, and please subscribe our Update World 24 YouTube channel for more update news.